Hello everyone, it's Imran here. Welcome back to another video. So I'm going to react to the newest SMR movie and this one is called Junior's Twin. So yeah, this is the newest one that was uploaded last night. The last SMR movie I reacted to was the KFC competition and that was actually a pretty good video by the way. If you want to go and check out my previous SMR reaction, my reaction to that previous SMR movie, which is obviously the KFC competition, it'll be on the top right hand corner of your screen. And yeah, so Junior apparently has a twin, a British one as well, because I looked at the thumbnail and it looked, it showed a picture of London right there. So, yeah, Junior's got a twin from here in London. I would like to meet him, in all honesty, if he lives here in the UK. But anyway, I'm getting a bit off topic. Let's just see what happens when his twin came to visit. Links to the video I'm reacting to in the description down below as always. So without further ado, let's just get straight into this hey junior check out my new toy oh what is that it's a ball drone it costs 580 bucks my mom bought it for me why does oh. it cost 580 dollars <laughs> because it flies it lights up it plays music this is some military grade shit we're talking about here the public doesn't even have oh, no, this shit, Cody. I had to beg my mom to get it i told her i didn't even want anything for christmas just this it's made of you steel and titanium mom? and it's completely indestructible oh, well, i want to no. see it fly no. okay check this out <clears throat> I said, check this out. You got to hit me in the face. It's still pretty cool though, right? I want to see it fly. Okay. It broke. That's my one. That was my one toy. Oh, my dad's coming. That was actually quite What's funny. What's wrong, dad? Look, there's something I have to tell you. So have a seat. This is going to be a tough one. Are you oh, sick? It, no, it's worse than that. Are you dying? Oh, I wish I... I mean, Cody, you really shouldn't fly that thing in the house. You should really fly it outside if you wanted to fly it. I was. Look, Junior, you have a twin brother. <gasps> I have a twin brother? Yeah, when you were born, there were actually two of you. But I was going to pay child support for two kids. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> so I shipped your twin brother to London, home of the Briz. Well, can I meet him? Yeah, he's actually coming to visit for a week. <gasps> When's he going to be here? Looks like that's him. So have fun. <laughs> Cody, I have a twin brother. Yeah, I wonder if he's hot. Well, he looks just like me. Yeah, so he's probably hot. Yeah. Well, hold on, let me go answer the door. Hello? Is that him? Would you look at it? If it isn't my twin brother, Junior. How's it going, bro? Oh, well, Dad said my twin brother was coming and... I oh, my goodness, met. he has teeth as well. Oh, my God, and he's got a good British Before, accent. So what's your name? Name's Nigel, but not like the form berries. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't that a hoot? A real knee slap what that one is. Yeah, it's real funny. You know, it was a long way across the pond, isn't it? And that cheap, smug bastard dad couldn't afford first class. Had me sitting in coach next to a booger eating ninny whacker, watching Puss in Boots the whole way here. Brave little kitty cat that one was, though. Fighting bad guys and such. But I'm being rude. Yeah, he, he definitely me was. For a biscuit, or maybe some bangers and mash, some beans on toast. Um, yeah, come inside. Hey, Junior, is your brother here? Yeah, he's right here. Oh, who's this ugly mug? Oh. This is my friend Cody. Cody? What kind of name is Cody? What, is that something you hang your coat on? A Cody? What are you Americans going to think Cody. of next? A shirty? Maybe a trousy? Never heard of a Cody before. That's hard to believe. There's quite a few of us. Cody? That's a new one. Yeah, well, we usually do yeah. make fun of Cody, but we usually make fun of his fat mom. Oh, you like mum jokes? I've got a great mum joke I heard in the market oh, the other day. What is Cody, it? Cody, your mum ass is so wide, no, no, so fat actually, that Taurus mistake it for the Big Ben, taking pictures with it and such. <laughs> mistake it for you Big like Ben? Yeah, no, oh, like that is Cody. insult to Big Ben yeah, right there. What's his name, Junior? Nigel. Nigel? <laughs> what, like, like Nigel Thornberry? Yeah, like the cartoon. Oh, okay. Well, wh where are you from, Nigel? Oh, I'm from London, isn't it? Oh, well, what do you guys do in London? Oh, I see how it is. You think just because I'm from London, all I do all day is sit around and watch Harry Potter on the telly. Cody! I, I don't know. That's why I asked. I... You know, it's a bit nippy in here, isn't it? Maybe you should go grab your coat off the Cody! Cody! Okay, I get wow. it. Junior, how long do you say he was going to be in town for? Maybe a week. Okay, I'll just see you at school tomorrow. You know... I like him. A right bloke he is. Hey, dude, you want to play Fortnite? Not right now, Joseph. I'm hanging out with my twin brother. Wait, you have a twin brother? Oh, who's yep, this bloke has. with the basketball on his shirt? LeBron James, is that you? Sprite Cranberry? Isn't that what you drink? Sprite Cranberry, like on the commercials? Oh, I don't like this my twin brother. Joseph. Joseph? 
Reminds me of McNan, Josephine. She made a mean pee and crumpets. Oi, Joseph! Just reference one of my TA. Really? Just How reference you know my. That? You just referenced that name. Just reminded me of by one of my TAs at college right there. Dude, it's all over your fit, bruv. Oh, dude, why is he talking like that? Listen, Joseph, look, I'll just hang out with you at school tomorrow. <sighs> okay, I'll talk to you guys later then. Where's Cody? I oh, miss Cody! Listen, Nigel, I have to go to school tomorrow, so let's go to sleep. Yeah, I'm a bit knackered from that long flight. Time to hit the sack, isn't it? Yeah, but what? <gasps> I got an idea. Nigel, we look exactly the same! So, you could go to school for me, and I could stay at home all day and play video games! Oh. Yeah, that's a good idea. That way the British keep getting smarter, while the Americans stay dumber. I gotta tell Joseph about this. Joseph, are you still in the house? Yeah, dude. I was laying on the floor behind your couch. Why? Dude, it's super comfy. Duh. Well, I just want to let you know that I'm not going to be at school well, this week. Nigel's going to go for me. Wait, wait, why? Because he looks just like me and I can skip the whole week. Oh, okay, okay. I'm going to call Cody and tell him. Oh, dude, dude. He's laying on the floor behind your couch, too. What, Cody? Yeah. What are you doing? I was laying down behind your couch. Why? Dude, it's comfy. Yeah, it's really comfy. Yeah, dude. very comfy, dude. Oh, I thought even Cody was going to do something. Guys, I'm not going to be at school this Wait. week. Nigel's going to go for me so I can stay at home and play video games. Uh, Junior, don't make us hang out with him. Yeah, dude, I don't like his accent. Well, listen, it's only for a week, and I want a week off of school. So just, just play with him and hang out with him tomorrow, okay? <sighs> okay. Oh, this isn't going to go too well. Across today in American history, we're going to be learning about the Boston Tea Party. The British were bringing a bunch of tea over to America, and they were taxing the shit out of it. And the Americans what? got pissed and dumped it all in the water. So to this day, if you go to Boston Harbor and you drink the water, it tastes like tea. Oi, what a load really? of rubbish talking about the Boston Tea Party like that. More like when the Americans threw a bloody fit over a little bit of spilt tea. Hey man, don't look at me. I wasn't there. No, speaking of spilt tea, I might fancy a yeah, cup right now. Anyone got a fag? Right here. I'm not talking about you, you stinky brit. No. I'm talking about a ciggy. Oh, no, I don't smoke. Dude, he's starting to get real annoying. Oi, pipe down, you bloody yeah, no wankers. Wonder. At least in the UK, our schools ain't shooting simulators. He kind of has a point, dude. And then after the Boston Tea Party was the Revolutionary War, where the okay. Americans bent over the British and made the British their bitch. Oh, what a load of corn <laughs> swallow. I mean, Are you sure more. about that? Oh, raw. If we went for those stinking Frenchmen coming in with their French fries, all you bloody Americans will be pledging allegiance to the Queen. Died. Oh, put a sock in it. The Queen's just waiting to win the gulag against Betty White to come back. No, no, she's dead. She passed away on the 8th of September 2022. Oh, my God. Nigel Nigel sounds really, really annoying. I mean, if I had a twin brother who was that annoying, I would... I would, I would get rid of him as soon as possible. What? And then after the Revolutionary War, we erected our first president. George Washington, he's on the one dollar bill because he's number one. You mean the bloke with the disgusting wooden yellow teeth? If you Americans had free health care, he'd be rocking pearly whites like mine. I, I really can't. Yeah, you, you've got disgusting yellow teeth. All right, Cross, that does it for today's lesson. So go around and brag about all the American history you learned today. Have a good day. That's the end of a school day. A little short, isn't it? That's why you bloody Americans are so stupid with your summer vacations. Guys, what's wrong with Junior? That's not- Oh, look at this end. What? Oh, you want a snog? Excuse me? Oh, if you let me take you out, I'll be chuffed oh. a bit. Um, no. Whatever, you stinky moggy. Okay. Wow, Junior, that was harsh, I, I think. You want to go play some cricket? You mean baseball, dude? Yeah, come on. Okay. Oh, what am I supposed to do with this thing? Beat my mother with it? Or whatever you Americans do with your anger problems and depression? That's, That's what most people would do to themselves. Use a baseball. Dude, I've been blocking him out the whole He's time. never played it's baseball, baseball before. It's a baseball bat. You just hit the ball with it. This ain't no bloody cricket. Come on, let's play a man's game. So, we do cricket here in the UK, while over in America, they do baseball. It's American baseball. Nothing but men play this sport. Throw the ball, Cody. Yeah. Oh, what kind of throw is that? You throw like a sissy! Like a sissy! Dude, that was a pretty bad throw. Well, you throw it then. Okay. Watch this! Uh, uh. Oh, that was a good wow, hit. Wow, dude, he actually hit a home run! God damn it, now we're never gonna hear the end of it. Oh, you say that? I'm blasting it over the bloody fence! I'm better at an American sport yep, than we you, saw that. Are. Now, who's got a bottle of water? I'm bloody parts, like you stupid Americans say in your Christmas song with the pear trees. He's actually oh, mocking the Americans. Oh, water. So you guys had a fun time hanging out with Nigel today? Kill me. Junior, he's the most annoying person I've ever met. 
Buddy, he hasn't called me Cody all day, and I think he forgot. Cody, can you pass me that bottle of water, dude? Cody! I almost forgot your name is Cody! Hey, Joseph! Can you believe his well, fucking name goes is his Cody? Tongue. Oh, wait till you find out his last name, dude. Oh, and what's your last name, Cody? Nobody tell him my last name. Oh, come on, Cody! They're gonna tell him. Enough. Come on, Cody, we gotta know. Yeah, Cody! Oh, Joseph's gonna put it. It's yeah. nut kiss. Yeah! yeah. Nut kiss! Oh, we're right then. Dude, you sound like oh. the gecko from the wow. gecko commercial. Oh, you mean like switching to Geico can save you 15% or more on car insurance? Wow, yeah, he's going a bit overkill right there. You know, all this yelling's got me a bit famished. How about we go grab some grub? Oh, Ginny, has he met Chef Pee Pee yet? Chef Pee Pee? Like penis? Yeah. Oh, we're right then. Yeah, let's go meet Chef Pee Pee, Nigel. Oh, no. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Cody, every time Cody says that, he goes. He goes from, oh, really? And Cody, and then when Cody tells him, yeah, and he's like, oh, okay then. Make it for Keto. Hey, Chef Pee Pee. Oh, is this Chef Penis? Junior, why is there two of you? Oh, this is my twin brother, Nigel. Wait, twin brother? Oh, no, I quit. I can't deal with two of you, hell no. Nah. Now I understand why he was making for quittos. Because he quit. You know, before he left, he should have hung up his coat on the Cody. <laughs> Really that joke's getting a bit old now. Oh, just give me some car keys and me and Cody will drive there. Wait, do you even have a license? No, but I drove me Nan's lorry all the time. Come on. Man, American oh, cars are weird well. with a steering wheel on the left-hand side. Yeah, how about you drive on the right side of the road? Screw your American driving laws. The left side of the road is much better. Oh, shoot, he's you driving on the wrong side miles. of the road, he is. kilometers too, you bloody oh. midgets. Yeah, yeah, okay, can, can we just get on the right side of the road before you kill someone? All right, fine. Well, he did in the end. Why don't you ready? Oh, right, Gov, can I got a kitty meal fish fillet of chips with Dr. Pepper, a froggy in a hammock with a little bit of toad in the hole, and don't forget my tartar sauce with my piggies in a blanket. Second. It's not a pepper's good, is it, Cody? I wouldn't know. I just got chocolate milk. It has a mustache oh, on it. Oh, yeah, and I also got my free medium I'm french fries I get from McDonald's every week, so everyone can shut the hell up about that. Oh, oh it's, it's been a while since we heard that normal. french fries joke. Been a I while since we've heard that. A lot of preservatives in it to make you fat and greasy. Kind of like your mother, Cody. You know, it's getting a little bit nippy in here. My nips could cut through glass right now. If only someone could hand me a what? coat. How about oh you? Oh my god, he's. Uh, actually, you Stop. know what? Stop. That, 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 that legit is getting annoying. They play here in America. All right, what's the game? The game is called Get in the Box. All right, how do you play? You just get in the box, and whoever can stay in the box the longest wins. All right, what's in it for me? Uh, oh. I'll give you a lolly. Ooh, what flavor lolly? Uh, it doesn't matter, just get in the box. All right, I love lollies. Yeah, that's great. That's All right, great. what do I do now? You just stay in the box, and then I'll close it. <laughs> Good thinking, Cody, putting him in a box. Yeah, now we just have to send him back to London so I never have to hear Coe ever again. Uh, <laughs> He's really still going. He just doesn't know when to quit. Yeah, just go drop yeah. this box off at the UPS and send him to London. Okay, I will. Come on, Nigel. Is that it? What country are you from? I'm from here in the UK, of course. I'm from here. I was born in the UK and I... I live here in the UK, right here. So, yeah, let me know what country you are from in the comments down below, but... Oh my god, that probably was the most annoying SML movie I've ever seen in a while. Just... Nigel was probably the worst twin, twin brother you can ever have. If he was my... If Nigel was my twin brother, the, I would have him shipped off to another country. Literally all I'm saying. I would literally have him shipped off to another country, but... Yeah, probably one of the most annoying SML movies that I've I, I've seen for quite some time. I could not remember the last time Logan uploaded an annoying SML movie, but yeah, that was uh, that was the video, the uh, video for you folks. So I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button for me. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought of this SML movie I reacted to, and also let me know in the comments down below what other videos you want me to react to next. Follow me on Instagram. Link to that will be in the description down below. Share this video, subscribe if you're new here, ring that bell to get notified for when I upload new videos or when I post on the community tab, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!